Hello guys, it's D to the B here, and today I'm going to be talking about the final episode of The Bad Batch. It was a mixed bag for me. Actually, it was a mixed bag for a lot of people, actually. They still like it, it's just it wasn't a great episode, which has happened with Bad Batch a few times. But let's get into the episode. So the episode opens up where episode 15 left off. Camino being shot down and slowly sinking. After the cloning facility on Camino is destroyed, the Empire leave the planet of Camino and leave Crosshairs and the Bad Batch to die. And in the cloning lab, the Bad Batch and Omega and Crosshair are completely split. Omega and Crosshair trapped in one room that is completely flooding with water, and the Bad Batch completely fine. The Bad Batch try figuring out how to get the others out of the flooding room, where Wrecker gets the idea of putting the knife between the door, so open the door and get them out of there. And Crosshair is completely trapped. One of his legs is caught in rubble, where Omega shoots the rubble that's holding Crosshair's leg. And when the room starts to flood close to the ceiling, they get the door open and they manage to escape. Then they close the door again. So then the Bad Batch and Crosshair are united and they explore Camino, trying to figure out how to get off of the sinking building. They explore Camino and they find the tube that the Bad Batch went through with the secret lab. They cut a hole through the floor and they go through the tube where the glass is starting to begin to break. Crosshair is like, we need to turn back. There has to be another way where the Camino android says, that this is their only option. So they keep going through the tunnel. And then the Bad Batch and Crosshair starts arguing. Record going like, you didn't even try to come back to us. We still would have taken you back. And Tech is like, it's a part of Crosshair's his nature. You can't change it and he can't change it. So then they continue to walk where the tube is suddenly attacked by a giant monster. And the Bad Batch, Crosshair, and the droid start running towards the end of the tube, where they eventually escape. The Bad Batch make it up to the secret lab, but when they get there, they discover the tube that led them to the secret platform with their ship is destroyed. And Crosshair starts insulting Hunter, saying, You shouldn't have disobeyed orders, and this wouldn't have happened. Hunter's like, That was our choice, and you made yours. And Crosshair says again, Good soldiers follow orders. Then Hunter basically says that mindless following, you're just a pawn. And how their conversation ends is Crosshair saying, because of your leadership, they are going to die. Where Omega says no or not, because they get the idea of going in the capsules and blasting the glass so that they can use the pods to go up above the surface. And the Bad Batch is all for this plan. Hunter does mention how do we control the pods, though, from hitting debris. And Crosshair mentions the droid can do it, which is a detail I forgot to mention. The droid is slowly dying because his power source is depleting by every second. So then the Bad Batch start planning explosives on the glass, and then going into the tubes, 
So then they blow up the glass. The tubes start going up with the help of the droid. But when he gets to Omega's, the tube is accidentally hit by debris and Omega starts sinking. But the droid manages to get the debris off and manages to make Omega go up. But unfortunately, halfway there, the droid dies and Omega's heading up. And then the stupidest thing happens. Like, she's like, I'm going back for him. And she just opens the pod like she's so stupid. And she almost gets close to sinking trying to help the droid get up. If Crosshair wasn't there to save her, she would be dead. So, as I was saying, Crosshair then uses his sniper rifle with the um grapple extension to grab Omega and the droid and pull them both up before Omega dies. But yeah, that had to be the stupidest thing Omega has ever done in this show. So then the Bad Batch and Crosshair and the droid make it up back to their ship and they just see the destroyed Kamino, which is just a river now. Hunter gives Crosshair a chance to rejoin the Bad Batch, but Crosshair is not for it, and he wants to go back to the Empire. And Hunter says, just because we have different views doesn't mean we have to be enemies. And Crosshair is like, I have made my decision. So then the Bad Batch start heading for their shuttle, Omega looks at the destroyed Kamino one last time. She says thank you to Crosshair for helping her. And Crosshair says that makes us even. And Omega says to Crosshair before they leave, they're your brothers and you're my brother. Then Omega leaves the planet with the Bad Batch, and Crosshair is stranded on Kamino. And then we get this last scene with the Empire delivering Namaste to a cloning facility that the Empire has been perfecting. And we meet up with this new character that says, we are inspired by your work and the Empire has great plans for you and that's where the episode ends so yeah this was a mixed bag for me it wasn't bad but it wasn't good either but i can see how some people find it a bit enjoyable so yeah that's it for the bad batch and this series has been not too bad it has its problems, but I still enjoyed it. Well, that's the end for my Star Wars journey from watching Star Wars stuff in the future. But before I go, I might as well try to give some advice if the creators of The Bad Batch ever see this video, which is very unlikely. Don't do anything stupid like Record did again. Have less filler episodes, and mm, maybe develop Omega a bit. She's still kind of annoying to me. And yeah, that's about it. You have been a nice series, Bad Batch, and I have to give this last episode a 6 out of 10. And I hope you guys have a nice day and I hope you did enjoy the episode. If you have a different perspective on this particular episode, tell me in the comments. And have a nice day, everyone. And if you enjoyed this review, please subscribe to D to the B. And make sure to press the notification button. With that out of the way, have a nice day, everyone.